Okay, so for this one, it says a loan is amortized with level monthly payments at this rate, and the amount of principal repaid in the sixth month is 500. Okay, calculate the principal repaid in the 30th month. Okay, well, first of all, I just want to establish the notations or formulas that we might want to keep in mind before we start this problem. Well, the first things first is how would we uh, find the interest uh, given at a certain time, right? It would be the balance at a certain time prior, right? At t minus one. So interest at a certain time would be the balance at the time prior times the uh, interest rate, right? That's how we find. That's how we would find an interest payment, uh, an outstanding balance at time t would be denoted as the balance prior uh, accumulated times. Uh, accumulated by whatever time that we are looking uh, that we are looking at uh, minus um, the payments that we made on right so if I were to be if I were given a loan and if I want to buy the balance of it at a certain time I would uh, I would accumulate it because uh, interest would grow on it. I would accumulate it up until the time that I'm looking for. And on top of that, subtract what I've paid to find that the outstanding balance at a given time. Now, to find the principal at a given time, principal paid at a given time, it's always um, R. It's denoted, it's denoted R minus I, which represents a uh, payment minus interest. Or we could just write payment that you make minus the interest payment that you make, right? And um, now in order to find um, the amount of uh, principal at a given time based on accumulation, it would be uh, P uh, equals to uh, principal at a given time, at a given time times one, an effective rate to the uh, to the K, which would be denoted as the number of payments occurring minus the uh, minus the amount of uh, payments that have already elapsed. And if I did explain the fourth um, equation in an unclear way, we're going to see what, um, see what we're talking about once we deal with this problem. So now for this one, it says, um, a loan is amortized with level monthly payments at this rate. The amount of principal repaid in the six months is 500, calculate the principal repaid in the 30th month. So now, again, um, we want to calculate the principal repaid in the 30th month, given the principal repaid in the six month, right? So the equation that we're going to have to use is this one, right? So what is the principal repaid? So now I said that this equation consists of a given principal at a certain time, right? So at a certain time at the sixth month, it would be 500, right? Times the effective rate of one plus. Since these payments are given monthly, it's gonna be denoted one plus J, right? To the number of payments that um, to the number of payments that have 
that we have. So what we're looking at is that we need to find the principal review in the 30th month, right? So we're going to do 30 minus the amount that has already elapsed, which we've been given here, so minus six months, right? Now I'm going to now uh, convert the annual effective interest rate to uh, monthly, right? Yeah, I'm going to do uh, 1.1 to the 1 divided by 12 minus 1. And again, 0 0.00797414. So this is going to become 500 times 1.00797414. To the 24th power, down this off. Two plus one to the 24th power times 500. And I'm gonna get 605 as the answer. So for the test, I suggest that you guys uh, memorize these concepts.